And I know you have very busy schedule traveling all over the world as a soloist, but you ever find time to teach when you are at I home? do. I have, uh, I did build a cello class in um, Paris at the Fondation Louis Vuitton. So it's a very, very special program that uh, I'm very uh, proud that we were able to, mm -hmm. um, to realize it. And my idea was to make a, a, a program which, which is for students who finished already um, and graduate from a big school, which is mm -hmm. kind of like, uh, um, Juilliard School, or Curtis, or Paris Music School, <gasps> London, uh, Berlin. And, and you know, when you finish, you, you want to work, you're, you, you're suddenly outside in the professional life because you finished the school, but most of the time you still need some 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 advice and 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 of course we always need to work all the life we work but the, mm -hmm. but the work is is um, getting transformed over the years and you you learn how to how to learn by yourself actually how to but but most of the time the this this break is really sudden from a moment to the other one mm -hmm. and so for me this this class is also a kind of transition from the end of the schools to to the professional life and so we have six sessions a year oh, six. where we of course uh -huh. for three to four days so at the end of the year it's it's almost like a normal cycle we spend 25 to 30 hours together wow. so it's really it's a lot and of course we work on on uh, uh, cello repertoire and and but also we try to talk about all the things which is around and which they will uh, be confronted as professional musicians and, and, and which can um, be many things talking about the the stress of going on stage uh, how to how to meet uh, concert uh, promoters and how to perform how to record i mean all those questions that we don't necessarily always know with whom we can talk about it and yes. uh -huh. it's also a program which uh, which is for all the cellists around the world so mm -hmm. six of them are chosen every year wow. and it's, Only six, it's, right? it's really like it's a, very difficult to get in. like a little family it's, it's it's really incredible for me it's 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 very uh, it's very emotional to to work together through this this year and have having this this amazingly talented young kids who come from all around the world and they meet together and and we share so much of course about the music but it's also very a very personal um, way and approach of, of basically learning together and I think everything is a everything is an exchange everything is sharing and um, giving them also the opportunity to perform every session at the beautiful Fondation Louis Vuitton which I saw is made you by, too, by yeah. Frank Gehry so this building, That's beautiful building. we are so lucky to, oh, to be able to work in, in, in such conditions yes yes oh. it's, it's absolutely stunning maybe one day I could interview there in the building absolutely and I want to you're most welcome to okay. interview them and to talk about them no 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 you no them about I, them. It's important so so you them. say how many years you've been doing the this? Uh, uh, this is the fifth season. So we're going to start the sixth season in, in September, and and uh, auditions will be I think in October. When, so October. Uh, all the young cellists who wants to apply. But you only you only pick six people. That's yeah. very difficult to get in. Yes, it's, they have it's to be super talented, yeah, yes. and they're going to be the but next. It's a, but it's a great opportunity. 